Well, on the eve of this game one of the NBA Finals, downtown Milwaukee is buzzing with Bucks excitement. Fox 6's Casey Kern is joining us live now from the Deer District, where two watch parties will be held tomorrow, one inside the arena and one outside, Casey. Steph, we are expecting crowds like we've never seen before. Sure, the game is away, but Bucks fans are coming to the Deer District to play. That also means nearby businesses are scoring a taste of finals fever. It's been super great. Just a stone's throw away from the home of the Milwaukee Bucks. I'm definitely seeing a lot of tourists. The team's success is proving to be a slam dunk for nearby businesses. The amount of people here right now is greater than our 2019 numbers, which is so encouraging. At the Wisconsin Cheese Mart, locals and opposing fans alike can agree on one thing, and they're dropping cheddar to get it. Enough cheese for everyone to go around. The big cheese here, co-owner Melissa McNulty, says they've been so busy it's been difficult keeping inventory stocked. Open daily from 10 a.m. until 6 p.m. McNulty says on game days, they're seeing fans ahead of Deer District watch parties. On off days, foot traffic from those visiting the pro shop. We love the fact that we can educate those customers about the wonderful Wisconsin cheese products that we sell. Customers from near and far who are bringing a taste of Wisconsin home and experiencing a vibrant downtown Milwaukee in the process. The people here are amazing. I'm super proud of that. I get to see that on an almost daily basis. We're so happy that the rest of the world can kind of see a little bit of that. Visit Milwaukee estimates each home playoff game brought about $3 million in revenue to the city. Tourism officials there estimate that the NBA Finals will boost that number even higher. Reporting live in the Deer District, Casey Cronus, Fox 6 News. My favorite sign from your story was cheese travels well. Amen to that. Just keep it on ice. It Casey, does. thank you. Well, still ahead right here at 9.